This week has been an emotional roller coaster to say the least, from System being released on the Life EP to the weekend ending with P and B Rock situation. Please go tell your family you love them, give them a hug. You never know when it's the last time you'll ever see them. I want to thank Yeet and Nextel for giving me the opportunity to be a part of the Life EP and I'm forever grateful. I'm gonna play through the beat one time and then I'm gonna get into how I structured it. So before I get into this breakdown, I wanna explain how Yeet decided to arrange it. So he actually took this section 25 through 29 and he made it the second four bars of the intro, which is five through nine. That sounded like this. Now, unfortunately, that kind of cut my tag out, but it's not the end of the world because I sent him this the version with this whisper tag on it, which I never use. Outlet, 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 outlet. All right, let's start with the drums. So this time I actually started with this, this shaker, this syncopated shaker loop I made. It's got one low one and one high one. Then the clap, of course, had to bring that in. Hi hats. And then finally the 808. And I had to make this knock, bro. If I'm gonna send it to Yeet. In terms of processing on the drums, nothing too crazy, just EQ and uh, some saturation on the clap and the 808 with Maximus. Moving on to the melody, um, for this one I actually used Omnisphere for all of it. Um, just basic presets inside, some of the stock ones. So the first sound I used was this kind of Rhodes sound. So for this one, uh, I ended up adding gross beat and doing a, a side chain or LFO kind of pattern to make it wobbly. I EQ'd it a little bit. And then I use this plugin called Akon Digital Multiply, which is a stereo chorus. It's absolutely free and awesome. I've been using it for years on everything from in terms of synths and loops and melodies. The next sound I added was this kind of pad, misty pad, also Omnisphere. For this one, literally just EQ. The rest is in the sound. After that, I added this kind of retro lead synth. Also Omnisphere. For this one, I did EQ, of course. Um, added this panomatic, which is basically just makes the sound go between your headphones. It automates panning, you can automate volume with it, and it, you can do all the basic wavetable patterns. So if I were to do a saw, a saw here, it kind of has more of a jerking motion, and then square, it just 
from side to side just kind of switches back and forth but i needed that smooth volume automate or the panning automation so i did the the uh the sine wave pattern then just a, a quiet delay with uh a six the last sound i added was this weird kind of like beep i you could call it a pluck i like to call it a flim flam <laughs> uh, also atmosphere in one of in the drum section i think just eq on this one too and all together that loop sounds like this That's the beat right there. You just use this eight bars right here, which is cool. Um, thank you so much for watching and tuning in. I know some of you may have heard that I'm releasing a sound kit soon uh, called the Omega Sound Kit. Still coming. I'm um, actually releasing a beat tape alongside of it. Here's the two cover arts right here. Uh, all I'm waiting for is some visualizers right now from my boy Prophet Originals. Uh, there, his CPU just got fried because of all the work he's been doing and rendering and all that stuff. So it's coming very soon. The patience will be rewarded, I promise. Yeah, thanks again for watching. My name's Outlet, O U T L I T. I'm out. Man, like you've been in this for a very long time. A lot of platinum, black, gold. You know what I'm saying? Traveled the world, performed in many different places, and then now you got these younger cats coming up. They're obviously looking up to you like, you know, what kind of advice are you giving them to you know, help them in their career? I be schooling them on just like how to keep your independency, you feel me? Like, mm -hmm. if it was up to me, I, I would have did it a little different. Now knowing everything that I know type shit. Yeah. I just be giving them shit that the niggas ain't tell me, you feel me? Like,